evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Fake TED Talks 2016. <laughs> Group smugging will be happening up on the Lido deck at 6 p.m. <laughs> Basking in the crystal glow of Bono will be happening at 7 p.m. around Bono. <laughs> and they're reflecting on how much more important and smarter we are than everybody else will be happening constantly throughout the remainder of the conference. Please welcome your next big TED Talk speaker, Stormy Costanzo. Thank you, I am Storm DiCostanzo. Uh, first of all, I'd like to say thank you to Ali Brosh. In part because despite any evidence that I may ever uh, demonstrate to the contrary, I always have been, and currently I'm a very weird person, and I am comfortable with that. Now then, thank you, my name is Storm DiCostanzo. And in addition to being a professional musician and producer, I am also an amateur cosmologist. <laughs> Cosmology being, of course, the study of the universe, its origins, and all kinds of really fascinating stuff. Given the amount of time that I have, the subject of my talk may be a bit ambitious. Ambitious. But I've uh, tried to keep it just to the basics, even so, apologies in advance if I get too far in the weeds with the technical jargon. I know you can handle it, but I like to keep it at the lowest common denominator for any crowd. So with that in mind, here we go. Throughout recorded history, humankind has pondered its place in the universe. Many ancient civilizations study the stars, often as a way to predict seasons, improve agriculture, or as a means to attempt to divine the future. And while recent technological advances still cannot tell us why everything exists, the story that science can tell us is compelling. The universe is big. <laughs> Phenomenally big. Words cannot describe the absolute hugeness of the universe. Vast. Expansive, great, massive, immense, gargantuan, ginormous, colossal, titanic, immense. None of these words alone or in combination, can adequately describe how big the universe is. Epic. <laughs> Mammoth. Giant. Hulky. Extensive. Whopping. Humongous. Monumental. None of these words completely describe how large the universe is either. Voluminous, <laughs> ample, spacious, outsized, prominent, conspicuous, zoftig, hella big. All of these words are completely off the mark. So instead, let's turn to our imaginations. Consider the Empire State Building. It is not bigger than the universe. <laughs> Big Bird. <laughs> not even close. And despite reports to the contrary, your mama is not bigger than the universe. Not only is no single person bigger than the universe, but if you were to take every person who ever lived and lay them head to toe into space, they would only reach into a very modest portion of the universe. <laughs> 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 
Space Oddity was originally reached, re released as a single in 1969, and it reached number five on the UK pop charts. After its re-release in 1973, it would become David Bowie's first US hit, reaching number 15. These facts have nothing in particular to do with the enormity of the universe, <laughs> but this seemed like a good opportunity to affirm that David Bowie kicked all kinds of ass. <laughs> in conclusion, whether or not science ever determines that the universe is infinite, we can take comfort from and be reasonably confident that the universe is really, really big. Thank you.